the world is going through some unprecedented time. Probably this is the most trying moment of our lives. We're dealing with a pandemic that we never expected in our time. Many families have suffered. People continue to struggle. But the message that I want to pass across today, as a Muslim who's just concluded fasting 30 days of Ramadan, and we are celebrating Eid al-Fitr, it is important to note that we are created by Almighty God, or Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And therefore, I call upon all of us never to lose hope. I call on all of us to continue to pray that God provides us with a solution. God rescues us from this pandemic. We're praying for God's hand because I know the numbers of families that are struggling today to make, to make basic ends meet. So my humble appeal and prayer is that all of us, if there's one thing that we need to do today, if there's that thing that we need to do now for purposes of humanity, is to unite and defeat this pandemic. The only way we can achieve good results is when we are united as a people. The pandemic has taught us many lessons. I can tell you for sure, we are learning on the job on dealing with the pandemic. Nobody has the expertise or a better understanding than the other. No city is safer than the other. We are equally susceptible. It does not matter which continent you come from. My point today is that we all must unite and we need to move away from blame game. And I want to repeat the message. There's that much that government can do for you. But you also have a big responsibility, all of us. So I ask, let us not blame each other. Let us not look for fault. I understand and obviously no human is perfect. But let us rectify each other when we need to. The end game or the main result that all of us are looking for is to see the end of the pandemic so that normalcy res resumes in our lives. As we have just concluded the holy month of Ramadan, we have fasted 30 days. We have prayed, every, I personally have prayed every night of the month of Ramadan. Every opportunity to say out of prayer to my creator that Allah is our burden. Make it easy for us. Give us ways to overcome the challenges. So let me take this opportunity to wish all of you Eid Mubarak and say that my prayers are with you and inshallah we shall succeed. God will grant us happiness. God will grant us unity. God will grant us togetherness. God will grant us success. Please, let's pray for each other as we celebrate this auspicious day in the Islamic calendar. Min al-Aydin. Kullu am wa antum bi khair.